Hey guys, today I'm just going to do a quick video with time lapse. The original was about 10 minutes. Um, and I'm doing a character sheet. I'm just using cartridge, like printer paper, and a number two HP pencil. It's the cheapest shit you can get. <laughs> so I'm doing a uh, emotion sheet for my warlock character. Um, he. I'm going really broad with the emotions here. I know he's not going to be this broad in the comic with his um, expressions, but I'm just playing. That's all you really want to do is you want to play and you want to really carve out um, your character's personality. So a lot of these expressions may uh, not make their way into the comic, but I know what my character's face will do if he goes this broad. Um, usually really broad expressions on a character that is a little bit tight laced are reserved for extreme um, emotional situations. Uh, and you use them sparingly because it will destroy kind of <laughs> the character's personality if you overuse broad expression and being able to do subtle expression is very important for um, anyone who wants to do um, like serious type characters in, in comics and, and animation being able to just do that little subtle eyebrow tweak or the way a mouth like kind of turns up or a wrinkle in the nose, that kind of thing will um, it will be very powerfully impactful uh, for the comic. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, so when you're doing these, you're basically experimenting with the character's personality and you're finding your character's personality. See this drawing I just did, the really happy one? face that's not something my character will do but I drew it out anyways just to see it um, this is like my rough emotions sheet I will go through and do a um, stricter one and a um, better um, one with more of uh, applicable emotions essentially for the character there are a few in here that I really enjoyed um, and I will probably work in um, eventually <laughs> but right now I'm just getting to know this character and trying to like figure out okay what would he do and what wouldn't he do and then uh, I will put little checks or X's beside the faces that I think will work or won't work anyways um, yeah <laughs> it's really just experimenting and understanding the way that the face works and if you are having trouble with this either look at animation emotion sheets or look at people pulling emotions. There are excellent references on Pinterest if you just write in um, expression, like facial expressions, photography, or um, emotions photography. You'll get a lot of variety of different photos and stuff of people just like pulling different expressions on their face. So um, that is a suggestion to do. I'm almost finished with this, so I will close this off. If you have any questions um, on this process or um, emotions that you think you should try, uh, please let me know in the comments and I will explain them or chatter at you about them. Um, if you have any suggestions for videos or questions on this video, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. I draw random crap every day. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll chatter at you later.